While many animals are active during daylight hours, there are also those who function very well in the dark. With night vision, portable lighting or ultrasound receptors, whether cave dwellers, inhabitants of the deep sea or blind, some animals are well equipped to live in the dark. These are the kings of the night. Certain animals have natural technology which allows them to live by night. Between the two big round eyes of the owl is a complex mechanism which amplifies light, however weak, enabling it to catch prey in the dark. Most moths, like this sphinx, have an incredible sense of smell in their antenna by which to navigate. Ideal for a romantic rendezvous at midnight. Equipped with ultrasound receptors, bats can detect both obstacles and the insects they feed on even in the dead of night. It's an infallible system, after all. Have you ever seen a bat knock itself out on a tree? Like many nocturnal animals, the tarsia has two enormous eyes. The bigger your eyes, the more chance you have of spotting your dinner in the dark. In this case, a tasty cricket. Just enough to keep a tarsia satisfied. Hey, save some for me! Glowworms have no need for magic eyes or other high-tech equipment. They have a phosphorescent substance at the base of their abdomen which emits a green light. And what's more, it blinks. Female use these little torches to attract males or flying insects for food. Likewise, fireflies have real magic lanterns which they use to attract a mate while flying back and forth through the tropical forests. Ah, how sweet love is. Staying with insects, click beetles in the Americas have headlamps on either side of their head, perfect for night driving. Whether they live underground, can't stand the light, or are completely blind, some animals spend their whole lives in the dark. This small cave-dwelling crustacea has lost the use of its eyes, so it lives, eats and reproduces in a complete absence of light. Termites are photophobic, which means they can't stand light. But for termite soldiers and workers, nature has provided for this by not giving them eyes. It's not as though they need them, as they spend most of their lives in the dark galleries of their nest. Where the oceans reach several kilometers deep, it is pitch black. What's more, the creatures that live there are blind. Still, that hasn't prevented them from walking the seabed for hundreds of millions of years. The sun may go down for all animals, but that doesn't mean that they all go to sleep. By the way, do all animals sleep? Interesting question. Well, believe it or not, some of them don't. Some animals have brains that are so small, they never have to sleep. Butterflies, for example, pull their wings in once in a while to rest, but they don't sleep. Insects, in fact, never even take a nap. Frogs, like most amphibians, don't sleep either. They hide instead. Although often motionless, crabs don't sleep. They move just a bit to change their hiding place and wait for their dinner to arrive. Contrary to appearances, iguanas basking in the sun all day long aren't really sleeping. 
It's more like a long, long rest. It's the same with fish. They don't sleep, although they go to bed once in a while just so they can stop swimming. It's a beautiful bed too, made of coral, perfect for a well-deserved rest. Now, although there are animals that never sleep, there are others with such large brains that they have to sleep. In Asia, these bats have a strange way of sleeping, on their heads. So, regardless of the weather, they can always close the curtains. Because of their huge weight, adult elephants have trouble breathing, and only the youngsters can sleep lying down. But that's okay. They sleep standing up, and it's even better with a trunk rest. Five-star comfort. Have you ever seen the vacation position? You sleep and you have very sweet dreams since your nose is in the flowers and your feet in the air. That's the way tigers and most felines like to sleep. The flamingo, like most birds, sleeps on one foot with his head under his wing. Of course, they change feet from time to time. Although killer whales never stop swimming, they do sleep, but how? They have a brain divided into two parts. The two parts take turns sleeping, first one, then the other. This system enables all species of whales and dolphins to sleep without ever having to stop swimming. Now, let's look at animals that sleep constantly, not because they're lazy either. Marmots don't leave their burrow until the beginning of spring, after having hibernated for about six months. Waking up is kind of difficult, so let's take it nice and slow. In the desert, it's just the opposite. You bury yourself in the sand when it's too hot. This toad can spend a year in his hole sleeping, without food or drink. You might call it summerization. Even more incredible is creogenation. This giant insect from New Zealand, the Weta, has built-in antifreeze, thanks to which he can spend the whole winter in the ice. The first rays of the sun have come to set him free. 